out there that asks the question, what if death isn't the end? Exactly. And can you change fate? Well, I got to talk to one of the actors from the new show, The Returned. Take a look. Well, you will undoubtedly recognize this talented actor from hit shows such as Dexter, Lost, and Supernatural. And now he's back in a new series on a &E called The Returned. The Return focuses on a small town that is turned upside down. But before I give too much away, here is actor Mark Pellegrino to tell us more. Good morning, Mark. Thank you for joining us today. Hey, good morning. How are you doing? I'm doing great. Well, I had the opportunity to watch several clips from the upcoming series, The Returned, and I have to tell you, I'm absolutely covered in goosebumps and absolutely excited awesome. to watch this series. Can you tell us a little bit about the premise of the show? Yeah, you're 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 doing you're doing great. I was I was waiting for you to take the ball and run. Um, yeah, the premise of the show is is about people in this small town of Caldwell, Washington, who start returning from the dead. And, uh, and how that miracle affects the people that they left behind. And uh, it's, it's very complicated. You, know, you think of miracles in, a, in a, a pretty much a positive sense when you think of them, but the reality of them is, is definitely a far different thing. And that's what the people who are returning discover and the, and the people that they've left behind find that it's a very, very complicated business, this thing of returning. Now, you're saying these people that have long since passed away have returned. They haven't aged at all, they look the same, and they don't have any memory of actually having died. How are they received by their loved ones when they come back? Is it all happy and, oh, we missed you? Or are there maybe some other different kinds of reactions as well? Yeah, it's complicated. It's definitely complicated. For my, my daughter, who died four years previous to where, where the show starts in a, in a bus accident, when she comes back, uh, it affects the entire family dynamic uh, differently. I, I take in her return differently from my wife, who takes it in differently from her surviving sister, and then others that uh, may or may not become privy to to her return. And, and, and Camille herself, my daughter, who, who comes back, she she has a very complicated emotional circumstance, having left a family in one state and returning to it when it's in another state, having left behind a boyfriend that she's still in love with, uh, who is, has now moved on. I mean, it, it's not going to be all, uh, all uh, fuzzy, uh, you know, happy tears kind of thing. It's going to be very, very, very complicated emotional di dynamic. And Mark, we know you from obviously several different shows and movies that we've seen you in. You are pretty much the typical bad guy. You love playing the bad guy. You're great at playing the bad guy. What can we expect from your character in this series? Uh, uh, it's complex. I mean, he's he's a complicated character, and he's I think kind of every man, you know. Um, uh, he's a person who has not moved on from his grief, but is at his own particular stage of grief, and who's alienated from his family, and and has a bit of a drinking problem, uh, it, you know, to try to cope with the fact that he's lost everything. And so I think what you'll see is what this miracle does for him, and and will he be able to change and rise to the occasion, and reunite his family, or? or not. I mean, uh, so he, he's going to be in the midst of some very complicated emotional dynamics. So, uh, and human simple dynamics as opposed to, you know, some of the, some of the other stuff, uh, the supernatural elements that I've had to play in the past. Okay. And the return, again, it is such an unusual but unique concept behind the show. Is there any kind of inspiration uh, behind the show and the series itself? Yeah, I, the show was based on the, the French series Le Revenant, um, which I think is now going into its second season. But it's, it's based on it in, in about the first four or five episodes, and then it becomes its own entity from that time on. Well, Mark, I want to thank you so much for joining us this morning. We're absolutely looking forward to tuning in to the premiere of The Returned. Thank you for, so much. Thanks, Heather. And The Returned will be premiering on A&E on March 9th. Don't miss it. Don't go anywhere. The Morning Blend will be right back.